Ó. Hello, and welcome to the Arizona Game of Fish Department's Ben Avery Clay Target Center. We're here to introduce you to our range rules to ensure that everyone has a safe and fun time at the Clay Target Center. Now, before we get started today, let's take a few minutes to talk about gun safety. First and foremost, when you hold your shotgun or you're getting it out of the vehicle, make sure that the action is open and the barrel is always pointed in a safe direction. Keep your finger off the trigger until ready to shoot. Keep the gun unloaded until you're ready to use it and know your target and what is beyond. And finally, always, always treat every firearm as if it was loaded. Whenever you're on the range here at Ben Avery, please remember that ear and eye protection are mandatory. There is no exception to this rule and they must be worn at all times. Sunglasses or prescription glasses are acceptable. While here at the Clay Target Center, please become familiar with the range rules. These are posted on the red signs at each sporting clay station and on every trap and skeet field. Now let's talk about shells. Only shells with lead shot in sizes seven and a half, eight or nine are allowed at the Clay Target Center. This means no duck loads, no turkey loads, no pheasant loads, no steel shot, no buck shot, and no deer slugs. Target loads only. Make sure you carry only the proper gauge shells for your shotgun. With some of the games here at the Clay Target Center, you will be firing at one target at a time while some allow you to fire at two targets. In either case, you may only load the number of shells for the number of targets you will be shooting at. For most games, you can't fire multiple times at a single target. To put it simply, depending on the discipline you will be shooting, you may load one shell or two shells. No shotgun should ever have more than two shells in it. At the Clay Target Center, we offer several different shotgun sports, including trap, heat, sporting clays, and more. We'll give you a brief explanation of some of the disciplines here, but if you would like to know more or have questions, please don't hesitate to ask one of our knowledgeable staff members. Trap is shot by five people at shooting pins formed in a line abreast. Targets launch from a trap house 16 yards in front of the shooters. These targets are always going away from the shooter at the same height and speed, but the angle to the shooter changes at random. Just remember, you may only shoot once at the target, and you may not shoot at someone else's target. Because of this, only one shell is allowed in the shotgun at a time. Skeet is played on a field that is set up with seven shooting positions spaced around in a semi-circle and the eighth station in the middle. To begin, all shooters line up at one station and take turns shooting at the targets. Once all the shooters have had their turns, they all move to the next station and so on around the field. The high house is on the left side of the field, and the low house is on the right side. The targets are always at the same speed and trajectory. It is the shooter who changes his angle on the target. Which station you are at will depend on how many targets you shoot at and in what order. It is a good idea to keep score in trap and skeet. If you get a perfect score after one, two, three, or four rounds, you can purchase a pin to commemorate that in our pavilion. Boarding clays is golf with a shotgun. We have four courses available to shoot at Ben Avery, three of them with 15 stations. Think of a station like a hole in golf, and one, our executive course, with eight stations. Out in front of each station, and sometimes behind or overhead, are two machines that throw targets at a fixed speed and trajectory. Each shooter will take turns shooting at those targets two at a time, according to the menu in front of the station. Once each shooter has a turn shooting, the squad moves to the next station. We sometimes have other options set up. Bunker trap, doubles trap, wobble trap, international skeet, five stand, feet task, and super sporting are just a few of the other disciplines and options that we are sometimes able to present to the public for shooting, each with their own rules. If they're available and you're interested in giving them a try, ask one of our knowledgeable staff members. Now, when you're finished shooting, make sure the shotgun action is open and the gun is empty. If you are shooting a semi-auto or a pump shotgun, take it barrel up and place it in the gun rack. 
That way, everyone knows the gun is safe. Over, under, and side-by-side -side shotguns may be placed in the gun rack, cart, or buggy with the action closed, but must be opened as soon as they are picked up. We're here to help, and we enjoy doing it, so don't hesitate to ask. Thanks for coming to the Ben Avery Clay Target Center. Have a safe day. Now let's go break some clays.